Hey everyone, this is Josh Galvin with Tizzish.com. On this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install the Google Plus One number to your website, to your Tizzish website, or if you're a non-Tizzish member, I'm going to show you the WordPress plugin that I'm using in this video that you can do. Okay, so here's the first thing you want to do. Let's go to a blog posting, or you see here there's a page, right? So we see two, we have two buttons already created, right? So what we want to do is go into our admin panel, and in our admin panel here, if we scroll to the bottom under settings, you'll look for a word called share bar. So under settings, look for share bar and go ahead and click on there. After you click on share bar, this page here will come up. And on this page, you have a lot of buttons. Um, don't go and change all your buttons. I recommend just keeping your like button, your Twitter button, and then of course your LinkedIn button, which is likely on your site. All we want to do is add a new button. You're not going to change any other settings. Don't do anything different than what I'm doing here. So simply go to add new button. And now on this page, the first thing we want to do here is type out the name Google plus one. And then position, we'll put position three. And then we'll, we'll check on enable. And then see here where it says big button. Now we go to the page that I've given you that has the code, this Google plus one page. And now on this page, click on tall first, and that'll give you a big version of the button. And now all you gotta do is copy and paste this code here. Copy. Now let's go back to our share bar. Under big button, we're gonna paste that exact code. And don't touch anything, leave it as is. Now let's go to a small button. Let's go back to our Google code page. And here we're gonna hit standard. Don't hit small, just hit standard. Standard is okay. And now after hitting standard, you want to copy this code. Now go back to our share bar. And here, we're going to paste that code there. After that, we're going to click on add button. Okay, now once the page loads, you'll see that um, there's a new Google Plus One button there. You may not see it loaded yet. That's totally fine. Just click on the checkbox next to, go next to the Google Plus One that we have just put. Let's scroll down. Well, it's still loading actually. It may take a while to load, so you may have to hit refresh on your browser. So now you see the second time around, I hit refresh. So now let's click on this checkbox here next to the Google Plus One, because right now it's, it's um, darkened. What we want to do is activate this button. So we click on the check mark and we scroll down. And you see right here at the bottom where it says where it says with selected enable click on update make sure it says enable then click update after it updates you'll see now we go to we go to a page so here's one of the pages with the buttons right here we'll go ahead and hit refresh and we'll see that the button has now been added successfully to your site and there it is there's the google plus one button now successfully added to your site so that's pretty much what you have to do. Again, all Tizish members, you have you already have this plugin, this WordPress plugin installed. So follow exactly as I showed you in this video tutorial. For non-Tizish members, either ask us and we could do this for you for a fee, or ask your website person to install this plugin here called the Share Bar on your website for you, and then you could follow the tutorials I I did on this video. All right, so that's everything. If you have any questions. Uh, be sure to go to tizish.com and like our page. Check out our WordPress blog section. We have a lot of items on that. And then, of course, go to facebook.com forward slash tizish and connect with us there and ask me questions there. Take care.